We know that already over 1 million Ukrainians have been forced to leave Ukraine due to the conflict. That number is expected to rise significantly in the coming weeks. Some estimates place it at 4 million, some go as high as 7 million. In any case, there are going to be millions of Ukrainians that are going to be in a position of displacement for the foreseeable future. In the longer term, there's two big things that I'll be watching. One is what access to services and labor markets and schools and other things will Ukrainians have outside of Ukraine. The European Union has said that they will grant them temporary protected status for up to three years, which is great. But those Ukrainians will, over time, need access to economies and schools and everything else. Secondly, when the conflict eventually does end, there will be a need to accommodate the return of Ukrainians back home to Ukraine. When those people do return, it's not just a matter of making sure that they have water and electricity when they return post-conflict. It's a matter of making sure that they have the psychosocial support that they need. These are people who have gone through serious trauma. They will need reintegration support. They will need jobs when they go back. And Ukraine will need them to be productive and safe upon their return. For more information, please visit CSIS.org. Thank you.